All right, we're back. And this time we actually have voiceover as we play. I don't need to make it up afterwards. I just gotta remember what we're, what we're doing now. And we're going down to get Drachma's ship from down below, aren't we? Already, yeah, I've already got that chest. No point going back to get it twice. Hello, kiddies. Hello, pow. I'm in a bit of an annoyed mood because I came home from work today and I was going to have steak. I had a steak in the fridge. Um, it was a spare steak from yesterday. I had to buy. I had to buy a two pack of steak. But they didn't have any decent one packs, and the missus is still away. So dinner for one, you know. I've never come out here before, actually. Huh. Cool. Uh, what was I saying? Yes, steak. Um, so, I cooked one of the steaks last night. And then I put the other steak in a Ziploc bag in the fridge. And I came back to it today. And it had gone off. Which was rather irritating. Yeah, so, I ended up cooking a whole pack of bacon that I had in the fridge and having that for dinner. <laughs> Lovely and healthy. So, I may not have won tonight, but I didn't lose. Right. So. Oh. Ah. Okay. Also, in the Dreamcast version, I think the visual memory unit would bleep at you in these scenarios. And there's charms around. Uh, my controller's just gone mad. Two seconds while I unplug things here. Oh, oh, oh it's back. Okay, it's still going mad. That is just weird. I wonder if that's to do with the... Um, it must be to do with the charm, then, that was on the ground. Hmm. The Xbox light started flashing around a lot. I wasn't really sure what it was doing. It seemed to be registering itself to different ports. Huh. What did I just do? Did I... Yeah, I just gave that to Cupel, didn't I? I must have just given it to Cupel. I... think I just... I'll have to look that back in the footage. I wasn't paying attention to you, John. I... I don't think you can eat. I don't think you can make um, Vice eat them. What? Fina's level one. Oh god, Fina needs a lot of leveling up. Okay. Um, when it comes to feeding pupil charms, there's certain pathways you can go about them to get different evolutions for pupil. Because there's two different, there's three different types of charm. There's the normal charms, and then the other two, which I can't remember what their names are, but they will make... Uh, one is just... There's three of in the world, and they're just for extra evolutionary paths, and the others will make people vomit all the charms back up again so you can feed them in a different route. Oh, nice, I've got a name rank up. Excellent. Um, and so giving them to him in, in different orders gets you different items. But we don't need this many when we're only going over to Sailor Island. Doesn't hurt. Ooh, I should check if I've got anything I can give, I can equip Fina with. And I can't change her weapon because she always uses Cupel. Fina's robe gives a nice little buff straight off the bat. Okay.
don't think he'll have anything really great to give me. No. Okay. Ooh, I can, I've got something to sell. Vice's old weapon. And that. And that. you think that here we would have a a shop for buying ship parts. You know? That would be a handy thing to have. We don't seem to be too concerned about that. I think there's a lot of things more honourable than just living by the skies. Like, not committing piracy for a start. But, you know, who are we to judge? We're enjoying ourselves. Not even going to say goodbye to my mother. Vice gets to live his dream. <laughs> well, we're not going to get not get back to Valua anytime soon. Don't need to go through the stone reefs though, do we? Let's go through the uh, the street. Ah, <laughs> Drachma. Never changes. She's very polite. Say what you like about her, she's very polite. Whilst I'm here, that one reminds me. I was holding on to a moonberry for this. Eat. What have you got to say for yourself? Ooh. Yeah. Now that's good news. I'll tell you all about secondary cannons later on. But they're very handy for battle. It'd be nice if we could get some combat around here. Level Fina up a little. No trouble now with these guys at all. Except for the looper who we can't seem to hit. Oh, come on, really? Now we see Cupel. Oh. No kill like overkill.
If I can get some more moonberries as well, that would be nice. Yep, Valu is definitely up to something. We know what they're up to. Seems nobody else does. Ooh, hey, duck. I got some moonfish to give you. You are the duck, right? Yes, you are. I think I have some moonfish to give him. Again, the light on my controller is flashing. I don't like what it's doing. Blech. Flame mantle. That's probably going to be quite handy. Because we're going into an area full of fire. There isn't something on this island, and my name ain't Vice the Determined. Fish. There's a Valuan ship. Could go and fight it. But I won't. Start off with six spirit, which is nice. Oh. Yeah. Okay, you're still really weak. I wonder if my controller's damaged. Still flashing away. Oh, that didn't kill it. Come on. Alright, now Vice is silenced and can't cast spells. Blah. And nothing sitting on the cable, is there? No. Alright. <laughs> One damage. These maracas are terrible. Maybe the controller's just emulating something the GameCube does. 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 Uh, during certain situations. I don't know. Oof. Bloody Alfina. You're gonna get caught up in no time. Revered voice. Let's have a look at what I've got. It's the flame mantle. It must protect me from fire damage. Can't use it. Not that great, the revered voice. Where's the flame mantle? Is it just an item? Ah, it's a dress. Okay. You can't wear it. Pina, you can't wear it. Drachma, you can wear it. Hmm. Nice little boost there. Drachma doesn't come into Nazir with us, so I'll give that to Vice. Eh, Vice is wearing a dress.
Let's go sell our discovery information while we still can. Oh. So for five gold, we can get some information on where Topple Rock is. Dun, dun, dun! <laughs> he seems very chipper for someone who's just given us the black spot. Uh, this is part of the GameCube exclusives. Very determined, thank you. How many of these are four? That's what I get. That should be plenty. Let's go get that uh, secondary cannon. There we go. Let's see. Two of these. We'll replace our, two of our main cannons with it. Buy one of these. Buy one of these. That. Buy two of those. Ooh, repair kits. The captain stripes, by the way, that I applied to the ship, they carry over to any other ship I get. Not to hint at the fact that there's another big ship coming our way, but there's another big ship coming our way. I definitely want to save before I go back out because I can't remember if the Angel of Death is going to attack us straight away. So this guy obviously gets updated stock as we as we improve through the game. There's a save point in here. Could do with a lot more money. Let's get something interesting done now, shall we?
Skies are clear. Skies seem to be clear. Okay. What are you? Merchants. Alright. Looks like we're going this way. Ah! stone Reef. Wrong button. Want to get to the map. Okay. That's where we're going, I think. Ah, yes, because the pass takes us through there. The straight takes us through there, but we can't get back over this way yet. So this is our only way through to this area. Here we go. Never seen the desert before. <laughs> Ike has got a overactive imagination. <laughs> Fina doesn't know what buying is. She's just seen us buying a load of stuff. Oh, Drachma. I keep forgetting he leaves the party again soon. There's my number. Didn't need to waste money buying him stuff. Bye, Drachma. <laughs> nice little disappearing effect there. <sighs> Air pirates without a ship. Kind of air pirate. Of course, there's a merchant here, isn't there? Now that I think about it, I'm not going to be able to buy anything. Sailor's Guild, ship parts, and the weird merchant guy. Any, I don't really have much in the way of gold, do I? 900, oh, I got a bit. 988, not quite a thousand, but could be enough to get some supplies. Maybe get a new sword for vice.
I don't know where all the items are in this place. Once again, the... Just was flashing like that. There's a charm up there. In the... Oh my god. The controller flashing away is making life really difficult, actually. And certain button presses aren't being registered. Pupil blade. Okay. Can't use them myself, they must go to. Magic droplets. Excellent. Sometimes when, when the controller when, when the cupel charm thing is going off, it makes the controller cycle through all its various ports it seems. I guess it's getting a signal from the emulator that it's kind of weird about. And it acts like it's not plugged in sometimes. Oh, I can't afford that yet. I can buy one of those. Or one of these. Agile robe. More defense. More magic defense. More accuracy. And dodge. Dodge! I don't seem to come up with Thuckran scales. It seems pleasant enough. Yep, that's a warp. <laughs> Ooh, there's a moonfish nearby. Oh man, that looks tasty. I don't know exactly what it is, but it's meat hanging on a skewer. Roasting over a flame. I mean, how can you not like that? Whoa! Well, this guy's having a party. I think, yeah, they only occur during battle. Healing salve allows one ally to regenerate health. Not that useful. Well, I suppose they are useful, but not to the point where I'm going to spend 50 gold on one of them. Ow! Manny's a little enthusiastic, isn't he? Ooh, there's something in there. How do I get in? Well, next time on Skies of Arcadia, we're going to get all up in that. <laughs>